All right, this is gonna be. This is the first time I'm playing ranked on stream, and. Months? <laughs> the hamster hawk guys on the enemy team. For those of you who don't know the tale of hamster hawk, let me show you. It all started with a regular match of ranked. Our team wasn't the best, but it was also the beginning of the season and we were in gold, so we weren't really expecting a pro team. Hamster hawk, on the other hand, he expected the world. I literally called it. Fucked. This guy, why is he so angry? I don't know. But this was only the tip of the iceberg. He started performing horribly and said it was because we were throwing the match that made him play worse. Yeah, you can't make this shit up. Do I tell him not to beat? No, no, no. He's got shit on. Now, he was like this for the entire match, all nine rounds. Now, luckily, I was there to carry us to victory. Just remember, at the end of the day, you'll never be as sad of a man as this guy. Who runs North Star and everything. And still got shit on very often. What a horrible human being. So after all of this, I bet you can imagine how excited I was to finally shit on this embarrassment of a child. Would love to see him rage. Now, before I get all cocky about beating this kid, it's important to note that this is the first time that I've actually played Siege since lovely. last week. I haven't touched the game. Confidence going in wasn't great. I've been playing nothing but Apex Legends and Binding of Isaac for the last week, so my siege skills were an all-time low. Luckily, I had good teammates. Well. Like top yellow. I don't think that was the play from the armor, but it got me a kill. One bottom yellow. Unfortunately, didn't get to have the opening kill on Hamster Hawk. But it's okay. One's connector. Still connector. I think one yeah, bathroom. Number 20. Connector dead. I swear I saw someone in bathroom, but. Still top yellow. He has a rotate into bathroom. He's in the other site. Maybe connector. Nice. First round was a success, even with my teammates' weird tactics and also my inability to play Siege anymore. God, it feels so weird to have recoil in this game, because, like, I'm so used to Apex, which, for the most part, has, like, almost no recoil at all. Even with my burning desire to shit on this kid, I wasn't going to let my blind rage stop me from engaging with my chat. Why is Ubisoft still not releasing two operators per season? They said the reason why was so that they could focus more on fixing the game and making other parts of the game better. The real reason is probably just that they're running out of ideas and... They just don't want to spend the resources to fully balance two operators per season. Wow, look at that guy. What a good streamer. Answering questions. On to the second round. I'm playing basement. Jaeger. Jaeger and basement. Come on, I just love decks, bro. Thoughts on how watching bottom spiral. The live build. I'm on basement. Got him. Sadly, did not get the kill on him yet again. Nice. 
Nice. God damn. Are you already in sight? Wow. Yeah, he's got me in there. I think one's top too. stairs. Alright, never mind, you all win. I, I won't even be able to put the diffuser down. Oh. In meeting, in meeting. I thought they just cleared that. Oh, he came from admin. He's planting in a very precarious spot. Is Ash holding? She was staring at the roof. Oh no. This is very losable. Seven months, Peter. I didn't doubt my team for one second. If this is really varsity, please review that Lions guy. Man is walling his ass off. Bro, if this is the first ranked match I've played all season other than placements and I have a hacker on my team, I'm going to be upset. Not going to lie, for a little bit here, I really had to think about what I wanted more. To stop a cheating teammate or to kill Hamster Hawk. Eventually I convinced myself that even if he was cheating, I'm not going to get him banned this match, so might as well just kill Hamster Hawk because it's the only chance I'm going to get. No way he's walling. Right? I also probably shouldn't have gone Cali because we have a Flores and a Twitch and a Sledge. Did I not hit him? Unfortunately, he managed to kill me before I could kill him. But I call bullshit. That shot should have hit him. I swear I hit him there, but apparently not. What garage is open? What's our Twitch to? I say, if she goes all that way just to get hit by the mozzie. Oh yeah, he is up there. He's still up there. C4 in. He's going towards He's yellow stairs. Watch out, Slash Maji's there for. Going down yellow? Sounds like. Very bold of Sledge to uh, drone him out and then just leave it up there and not do anything about it. Cool. I honestly didn't even see that Jaeger. On spiral now. He tried. I think he tried to send or throw the drone, but then he accidentally pulled out the camera because he didn't have a drone in his pocket. Yeah. That. Not gonna lie, confidence pretty shaken after that round. Felt like everyone was just, well, too confident. It's okay though, we move on to round four. Maybe hit the front edge of the car. I was aiming nowhere near the car. The only thing I can think of is that his chest plate went out too far, and I must have just hit the chest plate instead of his actual body. a c4 for it but this part here really did not help the confidence if you ever have to use a c4 for a rotate not a good sign kind of a waste at the same time we also need to rotate so rotation classic copper move yeah it's actually going to be an episode of Guess Your Rank. They're all pushing back from backside. It's round four, and I still haven't gotten a chance to kill him. Sad. Twitch and archive still. I don't wanna peek that because it's gonna cost me my life. I want to 
get on top of the green bin. In office? Stuck in the office. Still in there. Find the desk. We had an alibi with impacts, and I had to use my C4 to rotate. You reckon that hamster's crying to the other team like he did to you? Well, he is not the top fragger, so 100% he's crying right now. If we win this, I'm I'm taking revenge on like a on a high school bully. Actually, probably elementary school. This kid's probably like 12 years old. What are you guys talking about in chat? If you guys get timed out, people always are like, "Oh, the mods are too sensitive." If you got timed out, it's your own fault. Don't be fucking weird. That's all we have. It's not us being sensitive, it's just you not being able to control yourself. Because if we're like, as a community, we say, hey, we don't like this type of stuff. And you're like, well, I'm going to say it anyways. And it's like, okay, well then what do you expect? You're going to get timed out. Jesus. Another spawn peak. Fifth round now and did not kill him again. Okay. The fuck? God, my, I, my movement feels so weird. I just love dicks, bro. Oh, they're up white. By vending machines. He's by vending machine. Your spiral is clear. Out. They're all on admin side. Are we sure about that? Long death, long, push him on death, push him on death. One more at the back of long death. They're on long death still. We are sure about that. Still at the back of the long death by vending machines. Both of them. Well, hamster hawk, I hope you're raging. He's probably molding off his tits right now. It's like my team was so bad. I just love decks, bro. Hey, Varsity, still enjoying watching you play Siege. Uh, Gotta do it before Siege dies and you move to Battlefield. Even my team was shit talking the hamster guy. This is uh, this is definitely what it'd feel like to take revenge on a high school bully. It did suck not being able to kill him, but just knowing that he is screaming his tits off, punching a pillow, and blaming his teammates while he was the bottom fragger, it just, it brings me joy. Unfortunately, I couldn't get proof of this, but one of his teammates later did come into my chat and said Hamster was going off on his team in the text chat. He was blaming them for the loss and all this stuff, and based off his history, I don't think we really need to confirm that. We can just assume it's true. Moral of the story, guys, if you seem to be losing a lot and you keep getting different teammates, chances are it's probably not your teammates. Now, obviously, we roast this kid because he's an idiot, but just be better than this. Raging at your teammates isn't suddenly going to make them play better. In fact, it's just going to make them hate you and not want to perform. So as cheesy as it sounds, just be a good person. Now, the match is over, so I'm going to go check to see if my teammate was actually cheating. I'll do my due diligence. Someone 
in the game did say that my teammate with the barcode was cheating. So I watched the second round, I think it was, <clears throat> that they made accusations. Because I think I know actually what happened here. Because I'm pretty sure we had him droned out completely. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just love Wait, no. Dex, Where was he? Oh, up there. I just love Dex, bro. Hmm. I'm more surprised that he was able to hear him pushing, but I, I honestly don't Dex, think that was suspicious. Bro. I think it's because they were droning it all out. Because we, uh, from my point of view, like our team called out like three times. Like, there's two of them downstairs. Like Jaeger is downstairs. One other one going downstairs. Because Sledge droned out Malusi and said they're in spiral. And I was like, okay, I'll hold spiral. Sledge went into bathroom and was waiting, and then Dex, went downstairs. So it was probably just waiting based off calls. There we have it. He was not cheating. Which now means we have two legitimate matches with Hamsterhawk in them. One where I carried him and the other one where I beat him. This kid is just not going to have a good time in ranked.